The program, initiated by UNDP with support from New Zealand parliamentary representatives, was acknowledged as efficient by Luke Harris of New Zealand, who was excited to be in the country to share his knowledge on efficient handset practices that would benefit staff in the National Handset Division of the Parliament. And it's been great to learn just what um, the Papua New Guinean Hansard do um, and how New Zealand can work with them to help um, maybe uh, resolve some of the challenges that they perhaps face. Um, and we're sharing um, lots of stories about our two different parliaments and realising that we actually have a lot of similarities, Hansard similarities. We all face quite similar challenges in our work. So it's been really interesting. Principal parliamentary reporter Lee Zirote, who was also part of the program, says it was very beneficial for the staff of the National Handset Division to help enhance their responsible performances. Uh, it will ensure them to become uh, better reporters. Uh, that's normally what we call them, for, to effectively save the, our parliament. Acting Deputy Clerk of Parliament Richard Whitechurch said the program played a very significant role in disseminating important information on Parliament processes, particularly in the Hansard Division. So uh, it's allowing an opportunity over the next two days for staff that have not previously had experience in training of this sort to undertake some and understand how Parliament from other parts of the South Pacific region do the same work that they do but maybe differently or Mr Whitechid spoke highly of UNDP and New Zealand parliamentary representatives who were on hand to make the project a success so that uh, is a it's a good union and it's been um, mutually beneficial for us Papua New Guinea as well as uh, Pacific Island nations um, who are participating in that program Godwin Eki National MTV News.